Fast charging, large storage, and good performance are things we don't get to enjoy on budget phones all at once. There always seems to be a compromise. But that was until Vivo made this phone that we are checking right now. Hey guys, welcome to Tech Local, and this is our first look at the new Vivo Y35. So before anything, let's first check what we get in the box. It's just the usual white Vivo box and this time, it has a silver Y35 label. Inside the box is a clear jelly case with some manuals, a USB-C cable, we're also getting a SIM ejector pin, and it's fast charger. Moving on to the phone, I'm quite amazed at how this phone looks. We have a gold glittery plastic back case which is lightly textured with a metal frame which has curved edges. And it looks really classy. I actually have no other words to call this other than premium. It feels really well made and the dawn gold color we have here is admittedly a bit of a head turner. It's also nice that the camera module is only slightly raised which almost lies flat when the jelly case is installed. Up on its top is the SIM tray, and on the right is where the volume rocker and fingerprint sensor is located. And on the bottom is the 3.5mm headphone jack, a USB-C port, and the speaker grill. Up on front is a 6.58 inch, full HD+, 90Hz refresh rate display, and as for my initial thoughts, I can say it looks sharper and brighter this time around. It also seems to have great viewing angles and nice colors. Now taking a look at the specs, the Y35 is loaded with a Snapdragon 680 chipset with 8GB of RAM and 8GB of extended RAM. It also comes with 256GB of internal storage that is even expandable of up to 1TB. As of now, this might be the largest storage and RAM option that I am aware of in this segment of budget phones. I actually can immediately see the benefits of the higher RAM. In fact, I've already tried a few games on this but this is still due for more testing so this topic would have to wait for our review. Now powering the device is a large 5000mAh battery with 44W flash charge. I'm not quite sure but I think this is the fastest charging option right now at this price point. But feel free to let me know if you know of a faster option. This can charge the phone of up to 70% in just 34 minutes, which is really fast especially considering the large battery. Moving on to the cameras, the Y35 has a triple camera setup with a 50 megapixel main shooter and a 16 megapixel selfie shooter. And coming from the makers of the X80 series, I am actually quite confident with the quality of this camera. But I would leave these to you guys to judge with these sample shots. So I'm sure you're wondering how much this costs. The Vivo Y35 retails for 14,999 pesos and is available in Don Gold or Argate Black in their official online stores. At the price it's going for, I can say the fast charging, high-res display, large storage and RAM are what we are truly paying for here. And personally, I think it's very much worth it if this is within your budget. Anyway guys, I will be back on this for a full review so be sure to subscribe if you're also interested in that. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.